I specialize in ear, nose and throat conditions in adults and children. Uh, the common conditions that I see are things like tonsillitis or tonsil problems, uh, snoring, especially in children and adults, uh, things like nasal allergies or allergic rhinitis, sinusitis, uh, throat conditions include uh, voice disorders as well as uh, neck lumps like thyroid problems. We're seeing an increasing incidence in snoring in children. This is probably because parents are more aware of the long-term consequences of this problem. These include things like poor performance in school, poor concentration, it affects the quality of life and long-term problems in adulthood like high blood pressure and heart problems. So in children, this is uh, easily reversible with a short surgical procedure as the condition is usually uh, associated with large tonsils and adenoids. Another condition that I commonly see would be ear infections and hearing problems in children as well as adults. Ear infections commonly present with ear pain or pressure as well as discharge. This can be easily established with an examination in a clinic and a quick hearing test. Um, and in certain cases, medication may suffice. Again, a simple procedure may be needed. Uh, often these are picked up by the family doctors and a course of antibiotics is given. However, if these are prolonged, then they should seek an ENT uh, consult for uh, further assessment. As for hearing problems, this could come from a multitude of uh, conditions. It could be due to issues with conduction problems as well as nerve damage. Depending on the degree of hearing loss, um, various options are available. Surgical options would include cochlear implants for severe hearing loss and these can be done uh, in young children as well as adults. Nasal allergies are also very common in Singapore especially uh, and often the trigger would be house dust mite. Uh, things like other environmental allergens like moles as well uh, and animal dander. Common symptoms of nasal allergies would include uh, runny nose, blocked nose, uh, sneezing, especially in the morning or with triggers, for example, uh, dust when they go into a dusty area. Sometimes they present with post-nasal drip where they have a uh, lot of mucus that tends to backflow into the throat, causing them to have throat irritation as well. Treatment would usually include medications like nasal sprays and antihistamines, uh, failing which patients should be further assessed um, to make sure that there are no other factors that's causing this problem uh, and in certain cases surgical options are also available.